Hello everyone, this is Angela and Angela's Garden Sense. And look at this. I am so happy to take this video. This is my very first onion harvest. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Now, I bought these as onion starts from Dixondale Farms. Really didn't know what I was doing. And it was time to harvest. And the way to tell when it's time to harvest is that they get very, very soft at the bottom. So let me see if I can show you exactly what I mean. You can see here, the onion's not upright. It bends, it gets very soft. And once they fall over, it's time to harvest them. It's a signal to the plant to stop developing the bulb. Anyway, and we've had some rain and I didn't want them to get wet. But anyway, I'm coming out here to harvest. We're in between showers or thunder shower, thunderstorms today. But I wanted you to see this, look at that. Oh my goodness, so you see some yellow onions. You also see a couple of red onions. But what makes it really pleasing to me. I, as I said, I used uh, onion starts. I grew them all in two containers. You know these um, boxes that a lot of people are using and you see I still have some in here because they have not yet toppled over. Some of them are beginning to, but this stem for example is still firm and it still stands upright. These are small, they haven't bubbed out as much, but it's still upright. And as long as they're upright, they're not ready yet. So hopefully they'll get a little bit more size. And let me share with you the other container that they were growing in as well. Because I grew them all out here on these two containers. Not bad for a first harvest, I'm really, really pleased. But hold on a second. This is the other container. And as you can see, they're all not standing. Some are still standing, very much standing erect. They're firm. Oh, I can feel a little softness about to start there. Um, and some didn't get super large, but who knows? Maybe it's because they were in containers. But, and I see one back here that is beginning to droop a little bit. So yeah, it's got that it's got that little droop thing going on so I could actually pull that up what really surprises me when I pull up these onions is how the root system is really developed I mean even though this is a very small onion right here I'll certainly use the tops um, and I probably won't even have to cure this one but still look at the root development on that isn't that amazing and I'll put it down here as well but look at some of these roots they really oh, they're strong they're almost indestructible I heard someone say that and I think I believe it now what I have to do now is to let them cure for a week or 10 days or so and um, all of the green stalks will uh, be brown I'm gonna have to let these dry out too they really shouldn't get wet and I should not have waited this long um, once I saw them beginning to droop. And then of course we had a storm today unexpectedly. Um, uh, so I'm a little bit slow getting that, uh, getting them harvested, but still, I could not be more pleased. Oh my goodness, look at that. My very first onion harvest. I will try growing a lot more, um, certainly in the, well, next year I would plan to grow some more, but I'm going to try and grow in some in the ground because I think they'll have even a better opportunity for better root development. But anyway, this is impressive. Just wanted to share that with you. Thanks for watching, everybody. Remember to plant something and always eat what you grow. Take care, everybody. Bye.